What's up, humble beast? It's TMT Lamont, and I'm back with another video. So you see the title right there. You know that I am so surreal. I know I clickbait YouTubers, clickbait. This is not clickbait. I literally almost died. You will see clips of what happened and how my car is and all that, and I'll get into the story of how I almost died today, okay? It's crazy how life works, really. So listen. Yesterday, me and my sister were riding in the car, riding in the mother row, ver, sorry, no. um, and there was this ditch like on the side of the road. It's a part of the road, but you know, we pay all these taxes and stuff and they still can't get the roads together. I'm, I'm to the point where they should start paying us taxes, even though they give it back at the end of the year, but I'm saying they should pay us taxes and then we still get it back at the end of the year. You know, but um, so ditch, I hit it. It was like a loud thump, me and my sister heard it. We felt that, we heard that. It scared our souls. <gasps> Sis, you hear that? Yeah, I heard that, bro. Um, we just kept going. It didn't really affect anything. I was driving smooth. Okay, so I go home, wake up in the morning. I get on the car, go drive. I drive like somewhere that's like 18, 20 minutes away. And so I'm on my way back from where I'm supposed to the, the place I was going and I'm coming back, dude. Sorry, no, I'm sorry. But yeah, I'm on my way back. And then I, it starts rumbling. My car starts rumbling. I'm on this highway and I pull over like it's crazy just in time. I pull over. As soon as I pull over and stop, I see my tire fly all across the road of the highway. Somebody hits the piece of tire. So the rubber part came off, the rim did not come off, but on. So what I did, I was sitting in my car. I was sitting where the car stopped. It stopped in this middle place. I don't know. How to... Oh, you'll see it on the video. It's that's where it was stopped. Now, mind you, I was sitting in my car for like um, 30 minutes trying to figure out, oh my gosh, how am I gonna fix this? I didn't want to get towed because that cost a lot and I'm not, I'm trying to you know, save as much as I can, you know what I'm saying? So a cop, like 30 minutes into me sitting, maybe even an hour, 30 minutes into me sitting in the car, a cop pulls up behind me. The first time, this is the same cop, he goes off because he said he didn't see anybody because my car windows are tinted, so he didn't see anybody. He comes around a second time and I guess he seen me and this man saved my life. Shout out to this cop, you know? I think, I feel like he saved my life. Um, I don't like all cops, I don't like bad cops, you know, there's good cops too, but this cop saved my life. He asked, he um, gave me a ride to this tire shop and he got me out of the highway. He's like, I The tire place. Check this, see if there's a... I'll get you out the highway, man. You don't really need it, so you guys can do the work here because as you can, when I show you the video, you'll see how the space was. It's on the highway, but it's still like, this is a part where like emergency vehicles or something, like this man, should not have hit this. So I go and I wait for this guy. I called up this guy off Craigslist, my little, um, my Ese, he's a Mexican guy, you know, and I called him and I told him, hey man, I see your, how do you do emergency? Um, he was gonna replace my tires. <laughs> the tires so this man I guess he ain't trust me because I'm black or whatever 
you know what I'm saying? And I got the, these look like dreads, I don't know. I know. Um, so he wanted to get the money before we came back at it and did the work. And so we go get the tires and stuff. We got the tires right now. No, actually we got one tire because the other, the other rim was messed up. So I had to use my spare tire. So we got the tire, you know, spend a little money on that one tire. I was gonna use a spare for the other tire because mind you, two tires are down. One tire, the whole rubber part fell off and the other part was just flat. So I had to replace both of them. So we get all the stuff. Now we took a long time to get to the money because the Huntington Bank, something was wrong with them. They weren't doing withdrawals. That's what the bank I have, even though you don't need to know that, but that's what I have. And we couldn't find none. So we're finally like, let's go back to where by my car is and let's see if there's a Huntington over there that's open. We pulling up and I see the cops, the cops are here. That's crazy. That's my hoodie. That's my hoodie. My hoodie. That's my hoodie. said it was okay. Supposed to get your information? Uh, yeah, it's a rental car. Don't take any pictures. I won't take any pictures of you. Don't make pictures of me. Huh? I won't take any pictures of you. Don't take pictures of me. Take pictures of the car or whatever. I I didn't take any pictures. No, it's, I won't either. I, I mean, uh, it's a rental car. It's a Hertz rental car. It's a rent car? Yeah, it's a Hertz rental car. What'd you say? Yeah, I already did. I took a video. I have my camera on I'm recording. Yeah, I got all the... Uh, do I get your insurance license? That's my jack over there. What? It's right here. It's a cop. That's not your cop, right? Yes. Okay. Are, you, are you shaking? Are you cold or are you nervous? I'm cold. You're cold. Go ahead and have a seat. Why have a seat in his car, okay? Like where my car is supposed to be, it's not there at all. I'm like, dude, did this nigga just set me up? Do we have to hit? Like, I hit with essays too, you know what I'm saying? But um, nah, the car was we're supposed to be facing, you're going to, again, you're going to see the video. The car is supposed to be facing the right way. This man hits my car. I'm not in the car, thank you. And the reason why I say I almost died because I should have been in that car. You know what I'm saying? Because the cop saved my life. He said, get off the street. He helped me get off and he took me to the car place. If it wasn't for him, I probably would have been dead. Cause you know what I'm saying, man? Uh, Maybe, I don't know if I would've still been there, but I don't know, he helped me. And so my car is faced this way. This man's 
says he didn't see my living car. You know what I'm saying? It was right there. It's a big, it's a red car. You can see it clearly. You know what I'm saying? And he said he didn't see it. It flipped all the way around and he totaled my car. And now I gotta, I got some, you know what I'm saying? I stay with the Benji, so I'm just gonna wait to, I don't know how many days I gotta wait though. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna get, I'm gonna get a car soon. This will never hold me down. So yeah, I'm gonna show you guys the video, and uh, I hope you guys enjoy it. I don't, I don't know if you want to enjoy it, but you'll see the video of the man that's hit it and all that. Uh, stay safe out there. Pay attention. Not like this old man. And then this old white guy. He's white too, so he's like he thinks he's gonna tell the other guy that um, he's going. To, the Mexican guy had his jack that he was trying to uh, fix my car with. And it got broken, and then the Mexican guy was mad about that. He tried to talk to the white man that hit it, and he was talking. The white man told the police that he was harassing him. You know how white people are, but shout out to the cool white people, though. But hey, watch the video. My pride was the cause of it all. I apologize for the flaws in it all, wrongs in it all. Cause you and me always be tight. Emily, every single thing. And even when it starts acting like a fool.